Colonel. And everyone's here with you. Perfect. Hmm, why do I feel like we're about to be asked for a favor? Uh, no. I mean, yes. Gwyn has desperate and pleading look on face. Let Tatsu guess. Gwyn is dying of hunger and want Linley to make big dessert for us. Not even close, Shorty. Well, if you're in a place like this... Exactly. I need to... Wait, what? No! I'm here because I want to get stronger. Come on, Gwyn. You're plenty tough already. But I need to be tougher. I'm still nowhere near Leon's level. Who's Leon? Now I get it. All right, so how can we help? You're looking for some advice? Yes, ma'am. Before we can say anything useful, we'll need to get a feel for your current abilities. Let's start with a round of mock combat. What? But you'll mop the floor with me! It's an exercise, Gwyn. It's not about winning. Exactly. Now get ready. Well, all right. I'll give it my best, ma'am. No use. My weapons just don't pack enough punch. I need better gear. Well, yeah, stronger weapons make stronger soldiers. It's just math. It's just wrong is what it is. Hmm? How do you mean? Lynn, what are your thoughts on what we just saw? Well... No, be honest, please. Okay, well, it sort of felt like your weapons were using you instead of the other way around. They were using me? Yeah. Don't take this the wrong way, but we mechanics have a little saying. Even the fanciest, most high-tech tools are useless in the hands of an amateur. I think that sums it up perfectly. You don't need a more powerful weapon. You just need more skill handling them. Without the fundamentals in place, even a magical wonder gun would be wasted on you. Start with the basics, huh? I never thought of that. We'll begin with some simple drills. Hold on a second. I have the perfect tool for this. Ma'am, yes ma'am. Thank you ma'am. Wait, seriously? This thing? So you remember it. How could I forget? This clunker's the first gun they hand in List East. You really think this'll help? Yes. And that's why I'm forbidding you from using any other weapon for now. But this thing is just... Elma chose it for you, Gwyn. She must have a reason. Uh, right. Sorry. Thank you, Colonel. I'll try it out and see how it goes. Good. In fact, I just got orders for some new missions, so why don't we go give them a try? Huh? Three 
three missions? Right this second? Stow the chatter, soldier, and move out! Ma'am, yes, ma'am! <laughs> There's nothing wrong with tough love. Some students need an iron fist. Uh, believe me, this is nothing compared to how she was back in the day. Oh boy. I said move your feet, not your mouth. Ma'am, yes ma'am! slinging that weapon around I think I could I ask for another round ma'am you got it get ready
pretty good, judging by the look on his face. Yeah. Thank you so much, Colonel. Now I know to focus on the fundamentals. I remember now. Leon used to stay late and just drill on the basics for hours and hours. So, who is this Leon anyway? He was my best friend. Leon was Arena's younger brother. He didn't make it on board the White Whale. Oh, Gwyn. I'm so sorry. No, it's fine. It's just, he was my hero, you know? Always looking out for me. Look so happy when he was around. I always envy that. And him. That's why I want to be just like him. She's right. We can't have you settle it for good enough. Wow. Now we've got two drill sergeants. You're right. I shouldn't settle for being like him or anyone else. I'm stopped for Leon back on Earth, but my clock's still ticking. I should focus on the best me that I can be. I realize that now. In fact, who knows? Maybe I'll even surpass Leon someday. When that day comes, I want a rematch, okay? Of course. I wouldn't miss it. Still, from the looks of things, that's a long way off. If you want to be strong enough to protect Arena from this. What? How did you even... It's written all over your face. You get these puppy dog eyes every time you talk about her. Uh, if even Lynn's calling you out on this, I'd say you should take note of it. Uh, I guess it's more than just my combat skills that need work. 